terrifying. Ha! Huh. Hey guys, it's Sean. Today I'm here with another new video, and today I'm going to be doing getting ready with me for Vietnamese New Year. If you didn't know, Vietnamese New Year will be two days from now, and yeah, it's exciting because I can be able to say New Year, New Me twice because of my culture, too, because, you know, I'm Asian American. I did a little bit of face makeup first so that it just gonna get that out of the way and plus nothing really new anyway. But if you're wondering, I use the Fit Me foundation and I just use that to conceal a little bit of places that have like pimples and you know, got quite a bit of those. Then I set that foundation with the Studio Perfect setting powder and then for my eyebrows I use the ColourPop Brow Boss. Can't live without my eyebrows because eyebrows is how I get my confidence really. Since you see a little bit of hints of purple on my outfit, I'm gonna be playing around with this palette. This is the Morphe Plum Pleasers 35P. I got this for a gift and I feel like she really, really wants me to use this. So I have an excuse for that. Let's get started. I haven't really planned this thing, but let's go. So I'm thinking of doing like a cut crease. So um, we'll see how that will go. So I'm gonna take a fluffy blush, and I'm gonna start with this top color first. And just kind of start finding my crease. I'm gonna take a, a lot denser brush and I'm gonna do this color, Plum, right over here. Yes. Now it's time to cut the crease. I'm gonna use my foundation and this little flat, dense brush. Let's try to cut up above, probably about right over here. I'm gonna have a fun time cleaning up my brush. I really wanna take this color really bad. I might take this color and then use this one as the middle shade. Maybe even use that color. I don't know, I think I'm going a little too crazy now. Um, but I am having big plans for this color. I think this is the beautiful color. I feel like I have to use my fingertips now. Ooh. I will take my brush and kind of fill that gaps in. Kind of like left it there because I didn't want to mess up the, the line. So I'm going to try maybe do a little hollow effect and use this color. And right in the middle. I will take a little bit of a highlight on my brow. Right over here. I know we're not done yet so I don't know why I'm doing the highlight now. But it's fine. Now I'm going to take a different brush and get that very pretty pop of color onto my bottom lash. For eyeliner, I'm gonna be using the Ico London Skinny Liquid Eyeliner in black. I got this as a like a travel size sample from Ulta and I loved it ever since. Oh, before I do, I'm gonna put a little bit of a highlight right on my inner corner. It's the same highlight as I use on my brow bone. Mascara, I also got this from a sample from Ulta. This is the Ico London Sport Waterproof Mascara. All right, so now that's done, I feel like it's time to do blush. I've always used this blush, but it's my favorite blush of all time. I know it looks really bright. It's the ColourPop Holiday Cheek, Cheek, Blip, Blip, yeah. This is the ColourPop Super Shock Cheek in Holiday. I'm gonna do a little bit more highlight. Same highlight from the palette um, that I used on my inner corner. Now onto the lipstick. I feel like I should do a color that's very neutral, so I decided doing on this color. It's the Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid Color Sensational in Nude Flush. So this is the complete look. So thank you guys for watching the makeup look. Now I shall show you the outfit of the day. Thank you.
So that is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.